Lido Beach on a Friday afternoon. It's not a scene you'd normally associate with a city like Mogadishu. But the crowds here are evidence that Somalia's war-torn capital is changing. There's even a police lifeguard. Life is getting better here, safer. Life is getting better now, we got safe now. Now we are safe, we, are, we feel happy. Now the, the life coming back. It's getting Very safer. Good. Yeah, it's better than already. Now it's okay. Life is getting better. Everything's going well. The life is going back. Thank you. Mogadishu still faces some big security challenges, but what this packed beach tells us is quite how confident, how optimistic people are about the future now. It's also a reminder of Somalia's famous entrepreneurial spirit. Life jackets, for example, a thriving trade rented by the hour to a generation that never had the chance to learn to swim. Life's better now, says Maryam Hassan. Before there was no work for us here at the seaside, but as security improves, everything gets better. And for Mogadishu's new elites, half a dozen beachside restaurants have reopened. A cacophony of foreign accents. Many here are back home from years in the diaspora. I love it. It's really nice. I feel like they made a lot of improvements here. Yeah, and uh, my kids really enjoy it as well. But the armed guards are a reminder of the risks here, in a country still struggling with the basics. The corruption is everywhere in the world, you know. But here, I mean, I mean, what do you expect? I mean, 23 years of uh, there's no laws. I mean, it has to be corruption. It's a big time corruption. But again, it's getting better. I mean, over the years, I mean, things will change. People, they never knew, I mean, what's wrong, what's right. Nobody tells. I mean, whoever has a gun has the rules. That's the law. But now people, they understand there's a law and you have to obey that law. So peace and progress here on Lido Beach. But will it last? Andrew Harding, BBC News, Mogadishu.